Bhatia. And my name is Hanson Wong. And we are here to talk to you about UARTs and Transceiver Synergy. What does Synergy mean? For you, our customers, it means that you can meet more of your needs through fewer suppliers and reap the benefits of vendor consolidation. The products are designed by a single analog, digital, and mixed signal team to increase the value of these integrated solutions. For designs that use both UARTs and transceivers, we do offer bundle pricing. In addition, if you have any questions, you're dealing with a single team and gain better marketing and technical support. Typical applications for UARTs and cell transceivers are usually simple and go to market quicker than other designs. A simple processor that often does not have an embedded UART or even a processor that has on-chip UARTs can easily connect to a discrete UART. The UART, whether discrete or not, will require a transceiver. So let's understand why and where UARTs are required. Using UARTs is one of the most simple and legacy method of exchanging data between systems. A variety of industrial, commercial, gaming, and consumer applications use UARTs to have simple debugging or COM ports for diagnostic purpose. UARTs also add functionality to high-end systems by enabling them to communicate newer systems with legacy ones. The other challenge that system architects often face is that UARTs that are embedded on processors are generally low-performance UARTs. For high-performance applications, XR can offer data rates of up to 25 megabits and support newer industry standards-based bus architectures such as PCI Express and USB. Some of these serial standards have been industry standards for 30 years, and in general, UARTs are seen everywhere. Zero transceivers are the easiest and cost-efficient method to establish communication between computers and peripherals. For relatively short distances, less than 15 meters or 50 feet, and a point-to-point -point communication, RS-232 transceivers are recommended. However, for long distances up to 1.2 kilometers or 4,000 feet, and the need to communicate in the network, RS-45, RS-422, transceivers are the best fit. In addition, our transceivers offer noise rejection and immunity from the outside world. For customers that are concerned of ESD-related failures, XR offer an extensive line of serial transceivers that meet 15 kV ESD protection. And lastly, XR offers a full line of serial transceivers that comply to public industry standards. For a full listing, please refer to our website at xr.com. Let us take a look at when exactly an application would need UART and serial solutions. If an application needs a number of serial ports, chances are that the CPU doesn't have enough of that. In applications where more than one serial port is connected, the embedded UART often fails to deliver the data throughput rate required. For designs that need to communicate with high-tech equipment as well as legacy devices, external UARTs are almost always needed. For many diagnostic ports, an external host controller such as a meter or other diagnostic equipment needs to connect and take over control. For any and all of these applications, an XR UART can solve the challenge. In addition, a whole range of bus standards are supported. These include PCI Express, conventional PCI, USB, I2C, SPI, and legacy 8-bit or VLIO. Products range from small package 1 channel to 16 UART channels. Some of the devices, such as PCI Express UART, can drive data rates up to 25 megabits per second on each channel and in each direction. Several enhanced features improve overall system performance. XR has online tools, such as UART Product Finder, or UPF, that enable you to choose the right product based on a few clicks. A variety of interface standards, ranging from PCI Express to legacy 8-bit bus, are supported. Application-specific UARTs are available in small packages, and feature-rich, complex devices are available in packages that range up to 176 bits. Things to consider when selecting a serial transceiver are 1. Distance 2. Topology and 3. Noise immune. The first thing to think about is distance. For communication less than 15 meters or 50 feet, RS-232 would be the cost-efficient choice. 
for distances greater than 15 meters, RS-422, RS-45, or Profibus would be the better choice. The second thing would be topology. For point-to-point -point communication, RS-232 would be better. RS-232 enables communications only between a computer and one peripheral. For multi-point or multi-drop communication, RS-422, RS-45, or Profibus would be a better option. RS-422, RS-45, or Profibus enables communications in a network with many computers and peripherals. Final area of concern is noise immunity. Since RS-45, 422, and Profibus is a differential signal, it has better noise immunity over RS-232. Other factors to consider when selecting a transceiver. Operating voltage of the UR and transceiver. If you select a 5-volt transceiver, Make sure that UART has 5 volt tolerance inputs. Do you need 15 kV ESD protection? Well, EXA offers an extensive lineup of serial transceivers that meet the IEC 61000 2 as well as the human body model standard. For RS-232 advanced features, EXA offers an automated power savings feature called Auto Online Plus. For RS-422, RS-45, or Profibus applications. XR offers advanced features like receiver equalization, stool rate control, advanced fail safe, and hot swap. Lastly, XR has more than a thousand transceivers in its portfolio. Thank you for your time. If you have any further questions, please feel free to email us at uartechsupport@xr.com.